It was the first snow day for many here in West Michigan. Some schools even notified parents last night of today's closures. News 8's Megan Bunchman spoke with several school districts today to learn about their decision to cancel school the night before. Megan? Well, many families received a text, email, or even a voice note last night from school districts about their kids' first snow day for this academic year, which gave them some extra time to find help or have a planned activity. We are having a snow day today. We're sledding. As kids across West Michigan celebrate their first white, fluffy snow day with sledding and fun, parents in school districts closely watched their phones last night to see what Friday would bring. You know, part of the dilemma is, well, we could get them to school, but is, is it going to snow so much they won't be able to get them home? Yeah. Dr. Steve Matthews with Rockford Public Schools says he and several other superintendents were on a text thread yesterday debating if school was still on. And say, what are you thinking? What are your roads like? Uh, and, and then we try to make a decision. For Rockford Schools, that decision came in around 9 p.m. last night, giving parents like Katie Brown plenty of time to pivot and plan ahead. It was nice like going to bed last night knowing like, okay, I can go to sleep and know that we don't have to set our alarms in the morning. Matthew says that while his district hasn't changed its policy or threshold on when to call a snow day, they are cognizant of using their six allotted state snow days sparingly. This would have been an iffy day in March because, uh, because you only get so many during the year. Uh, once uh, February, March starts rolling around, you probably have used them already. Consistent snow and potential freezing roads are what pushed Rockford to close today. It would have probably been difficult because we usually take back roads all the way to Rockford. And while those reasons were more than enough for the Rams to close their doors this November day, Matthew says an email from one of his high schoolers was the cherry on top of this cold, wintry day. Well, Shakespeare once said, why delay the inevitable when you know what will occur? <laughs> Coming up at 7 tonight, why snow days aren't always great news for families. We'll take a look at some of the issues a snow day may mean for other districts. Sue.